there was a time in, in balik na kang Moses, gibless sila ni Lord. Can say gibless ni Lord din eh. Gibless sila ni Lord. They plundered Egypt. Tanan gold sa Egypt, ilang gibit-bit. And then, after a while, nawala ang ilang leader. For 40 days, kito dito sa um, Mount Sinai, encountering the Lord, receiving instruction from the Lord. And then, they told one another, Moses is probably dead. Let's make a God. The God, ilang gikonek ang gibot ni Lord. The God who took us out from Egypt. Niya ilang gibot, they they nag, nag patak patak sila gold and they formed a golden calf ang blessing ni Lord ilang gihimong idol hello say ang blessing bitaw ni Lord ma idol na to nga kung mawala ang blessing mabalaka ta kasi naka experience na gi bless ka ni Lord niagi kag kalisod gi bless ka ni Lord na you acknowledge nga gi Kang, kang Lord kita pure the thought of losing your money or you losing your your money in the bank brings fear in you that's a false sense of security right so somehow morning gibuhat sa mga Israelites they bow down to the blessings of the Lord or they bow down to the works of their hands ikapila na ko nakadungog o tao nga Gapangayo o trabaho o gapapray, aron i-bless ang negosyo. Sa wala pa'y negosyo, sa wala pa'y trabaho, tasig kayo. Pero, paglambo na sa negosyo o pag, pagkabisi na sa trabaho, dili, wala na tayo mo simba. Wala na tayo mo, wala na tayo mo, mo cell group, mo prayer meeting. Why? They bowed down to the blessings of the Lord. Many Christians do that. Greed is a form of idolatry. Ilang na, okay, I'm not serving, I'm not bowing down to an idol. But actually, they are bowing down to the idol in their heart. 